how excellent. Oh, yeah. A video game brought to life in this classroom as students compete to see who can make the best automatic burger. Burger building bots abound. These second year engineering students at UBC had six weeks to design, build, and program the robots. Good enough to win a challenge based on the popular video game Overcooked. We just have to make sure luck is on our side and then we're good to go. The 60 students in teams of four each had to build a pair of robots which would work together to complete the burgers in a simulated kitchen. A serious challenge. Probably the most complex thing that we've got is actually just the mechanical motions required to pick up things like a slice of cheese. Like it, it's actually, even though it's 3D printed cheese, it's still hard. Um, so I think it's really been interesting to see all the innovative solutions that the students have come up with because we don't give them any guidance on that. The designs are entirely their own. Some robots wowed the crowd with their fast and furious burger skills. <laughs> Some, not so much. But that's not the important part. Students are getting hands-on experience with design, building electronic and mechanical devices, and programming. Some components are supposed to work, but nothing is guaranteed. Those hands-on skills are preparing these students for careers in tech. I could picture myself actually working in an engineering job and being useful and contributing to my team. And these students are some of their own harshest critics. I think it was okay. We could have done a little better. It was the last one. It was a little off. The robots don't need to win to get a passing grade. The skills built during the design, build, and programming are what these students are really being judged on. In Vancouver, Jack Morse, City News.